Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you how to texture an object and unwrap it. So we'll go over some of the basics. We'll just use a box for this one. Let's make it 100 by 100 by 100. Just to make it simple. <clears throat> and then what you want to do is convert to edible mesh and we have our modifier list. Now our modifier list can do a bunch of different things but the main thing we're looking for is a UV or um, UV W map. So there's unwrap UVW, which you can lay out a 3D object, or you can just throw a texture on it and adjust these stuff. So, but first, before we do that, we want to hit M for a material editor, and then we want to go here to diffuse and click on this little box and now we want to select bitmap so then you want to go and navigate to where you have your textures um, we will actually just use this for demonstration purposes so then you want to click that and go to parent so now what we can do is either there's a couple different ways you can do this um, if you don't have this selected, you can click on Assign Material, and it'll throw it on there. We'll hit Control Z. Um, also, what you can do is select an area, and throw it on there, and it'll place it only on that area. And then, um, yeah, so what we'll do is just throw this on there and select everything and go to it just hit U twice and it'll take you to UVW map click that and it'll look kinda crazy at first but these are the different things for um, like aligning your texture how you want it so we could do box and it'll lay out the texture very nicely across the box or if you wanted the texture to be smaller and stuff, you can adjust this for the width, yeah, I mean length, width, and then height. So however you wanted to change it up, you can do it that way. <clears throat> so if you're working with other objects, you might want to use a cylindrical and um, all that stuff. like. Let's go back there real quick. Yeah. Spherical and all these different ones, depending on what type of object object you're working with. So, yeah. And then there's also another way to uh, apply a texture. Let's say you have a crazy shape like this one, or you know you want to put different details on each panel like you don't just want uh, just one texture or the same texture going across the entire thing what we can do is unwrap the actual object so we'll create another one that's 100 by 100 by 100 and we will convert it to edible mesh drop down our modifier list just hit you once it'll take you to unwrap UVW and click that and we can open it up our edit tool now some of the stuff is kinda yeah so you can uh, disable the grid and stuff like that so what we can do here is we can uh, edit our box if we want so you can see the different faces and we can just select all this and go to mapping flatten mapping and there's different settings and stuff but we're just gonna do that um, actually oh we didn't have it all selected okay or maybe unfold mapping Oh, unfold mapping works better. And it lays it out in this nice box. So when you're working with maybe a, a bigger, more complex so, uh, mesh, something like uh, 
human character or something, it's going to get really complex, but the basics are you have to keep everything within this blue box here. So, if you don't already know what uh, UV unwrapping is, it lays this 3D object out flat. So if we select this piece, it's there. So it's pretty much if you were to take a cardboard box and unfold it and lay it out flat, this is what um, UV unwrapping does. So, yeah, so now that we have all the different pieces, you can, you know, um, export it out. So we'll go to render UVW template. Now we can set our texture size for whatever we want. Um, we can go 512 by 512 render and it renders it out. So what you would do is just go and uh, save it somewhere. You can choose whatever format you want and uh, yeah just take this open it up in Photoshop or whatever application that you use and just paint right onto here save it and yeah you can uh, after you have everything done you can just go to materials bitmap and grab the uh, the um, UV W uh, template that you created and save it onto there throw it onto here and you won't have to do anything it'll just uh, just show up uh, laid out perfectly so yeah that's the basics of how to texture an object